The father of my watch chief R3 Sanjivan wants Negeri Sembilan police to step aside and let Bukit Aman take over investigations, citing conflict of interest. The crime watchdog co-founder, who was shot in Bahau in July, had previously levelled allegations against the southern state's police, which could lead to bias. Sanjeevan's father, P. Ramakrishnan, made the request in a police report lodged at the Travers police station. He was accompanied by fellow My Watch co-founder as Gobi Krishnan. Ayahnya meminta supaya siasatan kes ini dikendalikan oleh pasukan daripada Bukit Aman selepas ini dan tidak lagi daripada Negeri Sembilan kerana ada dua ada beberapa sebab. Yang pertamanya uh, Sanjivan pernah membuat beberapa laporan polis terhadap pegawai dan anggota di Negeri Sembilan dan kemungkinan ada konflik of interest, uh, konflik kepentingan dan juga untuk keselamatan beliau maka kita minta supaya kes ini dikendalikan oleh Bukit Aman, we want uh, Bukit Aman to take over. Ramakrishnan also wants to meet with Bukit Aman CID Chief Datuk Hadiho Abdullah who is leading a special team set up to look into the incident. He says Sanjivan's condition hasn't changed much and that he is still being induced and cannot breathe on his own. He adds doctors have yet to remove the bullet lodged in Sanjivan's ribcage as surgery now may even endanger his son's life. The 64-year-old says he is also concerned for his son's safety. And because of safety of my son, I lodge a report. So please, I can't tell you because my, my condition is not that to tell you at the moment anything because I have a full confidence with the police. Uh, that's why I came to Bukinaman to, to lodge a report, you know, to safeguard my interest, my family interest and my, my son, Sanjeevans. Please, please. 29-year-old Sanjivan was shot by two men on a motorcycle while he was driving in Bahau on July 27th. Some eight hours before the incident, he had tweeted that a police officer had recruited a syndicate member to fire shots at his house. He remains in stable but critical condition.